Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to another episode of my trailer collection. My name is Eve. Thank you very much for tuning in. And in today's lot, we have 10 new trailers. We all know the rules. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 new trailers, which uh, will amount to today to 240 trailers. So we're almost nearing the end. One, five. Let's take a look. I hope everybody had a good weekend. A lot of places have been opening up this week. Uh, so nobody's dying to get out of the house. All right, so let's start. What do we have here? Ooh, Tony Scott, 1993, True Romance. I actually got lucky with this trailer. I found this on eBay for pretty cheap. Um, and considering this is sort of, from what I understand, Tarantino's, uh, I guess, autobiographical film. He did write the movie, and Clarence is very much like him. Uh, all right, what else do we have here? Oh, 20th anniversary is coming up in a couple of days. Uh, this is for Shaft. I showed you one before. Um, here's the flat trailer. I think I showed you a scope trailer. I like Shaft. It's a good movie. Samuel Jackson's awesome in it. Christian Bale, Jeffrey Wright, they're, they're great. Um, oh, another MI2 trailer. Is this MI2? I believe it is. All right. This is MI2. I, I what I saw in the core. I, I used a um, the label um, or I think head or tail of the Dark Knight Rises trailer flat. I cut it off and I used it as uh, I think tail um, for this uh, trailer, so I can attach it to other trailers. But here it is, I made a label for it. All right, so next we have, ooh, uh, Rambo 3, 1988, Sylvester Stallone. I ran this trailer, it's in my, um, uh, one of my YouTube videos, you can find it. It's got, very, got, got a lot of views, it's got like over a thousand. People really love Rambo. Uh, let's see what we have here. Ooh, ten years ago, uh, but the anniversary already passed. This is a movie that kind of, I think people kind of forgot about. Uh, this is Kick-Ass. One of the last movies uh, our theater had on 35mm before the uh, digital rollout, which I just made an episode about uh, before I started making this one. Definitely check that out. Um, Alright, up next, got a little Steven Seagal action with DMX. This is Exit Wounds from 2001. You know, I actually enjoy this movie, even though it's pretty bad. Um, it's the worst of the, the three hip-hop martial arts films uh, that were pretty popular in the early 2000s. Um, but, you know, whatever. I enjoy moments of it. This was supposedly, like, Steven Seagal's, like, comeback movie or something. It didn't do shit for him. Um, let's see. Up next, I have uh, 1992. This is Paul Verhoeven uh, jumping off the sci-fi uh, gory horror bandwagon jumping into erotic sexual thrillers, which ironically enough, that's you know what he was more famous for before Robocop. But you know, people kind of know him for Robocop in America. Um, but here you go. I ran this trailer, it's awesome, pretty good movie. Um, not my favorite Paul Verhoeven film, but um, it's still you know well made. Michael Douglas was the uh, Quite a sex symbol back then. He was the man. He still is the man. I like him. Alright, we got... Ooh, 2008. We got Daniel Craig in Defiance. I ran this at New Rock. It was Christmas time. 
very early January, Christmas time 08 into January 09. Somewhere around that time we got this movie on 35 millimeter film, it's pretty cool. Uh, it's about, uh, takes place during World War II. Uh, three Jewish brothers uh, protect the Jews from, um, you know, uh, from the Nazis. Good story, good action. Wow, did I go through all these trailers? I guess I did, right? Yeah, I just want to make sure. Yeah, I did. Wow, it's pretty quick. Uh, I have two more. I have from 10 years ago. It's anniversary already passed. The Losers. I think I showed a trailer for this before. This is an okay movie. Jason Patrick was the best part. This is like one of Joel Silver's like last movies that he produced. Um, I guess he's kind of done. And for trailer number 10 today, which amounts to 240, another true romance trailer. Man, I miss Tony Scott. He is the man, or he was the man. Um, yeah, True Romance is one of his best films. Alright. So that marks 240 trailers. So that's pretty much it for today's lots. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you again for tuning in. And this is an 80s Die Hard production. Later, everyone. Bye.